obviously to the, you know this is the big game and everything but emotions got a little high especially in the towards the ends of the game with all the uh calls and things of that sort how do you guys stay composed especially as a young team um going through a tough stretch such as this i feel like us leaders and like us vets have to really step up in those moments we got to really keep us composed i think we could have done a better job of that like we all were just kind of like losing our minds at the end and frustrated and like we can't control that like the refs are human wasn't great not even gonna get into that because i can't afford a fine um Should I care? <laughs> <laughs> um but i really think us, us veterans have to just like really step up and be composed in those moments because you can kind of see how it snowballed really quickly um so we got to be better in those moments of trying to like cut it down because i mean i don't know how many i they shot it felt like 300 free throws in the fourth quarter i don't even know if i cracked a sweat because we were standing at the free throw line the whole time but we got to be better the vets have to step up and keep us composed but even through that it's just a level of consistency and i get it like refs are human i do understand we're trying to do the best we can but there's at times it feels like there's no consistency and so as a player it's hard when you're when you're just there's fouls every single possession and so like you said in the fourth quarter it felt like it was like what happened? I don't even know what happened, but they're calling a foul, you know? And so that, yes, I do agree with Rachel. Like we have to be better. We have to be as leaders. We have to help be held accountable for that. But it's just like, there's a level of consistency that it's just, it's just not there. So that's just the one thing we're just asking, like, okay, call whatever, but at least be consistent on both sides. Yeah. Let's talk about that for a second before I jump into the next clip with Teresa Weatherspoon. I got a big problem when I listen to that type of crap. Because number one, here's the first thing. Rachel Bannon doesn't even remember the game. Because she said that she didn't even break a sweat in the fourth quarter because of all the free throws that were shot. I think she should go back and watch film. Because this is the type of thing that clearly there are players on the team that are complaining. And it gets in your head that people are complaining, right? Right. 